Welcome back again, guys. We're at Trying Engineer's Life 2. It's clearly the life for me. Realistic. We should be able to hand realistic and get our world generated because this uh, should be a little bit easier than nuclear wasteland, maybe? Hopefully. I've been wanting to play some of the 118 mods, but apparently Forge is having issues because I keep getting uh, Java memory issues and uh, crashes through the system with the 1.18 mods. Because the Forge 1.18 is still in beta. But hopefully that will be resolved in a matter of time. And hopefully this will get us into the world. And not crash us. There we go. Well, we spawned right in a village. In nighttime? Whoa, what is that up there? A little bit of a loading chunk. Oh. Good sirs, do you have beds? We shouldn't be loading at night. Oh, I guess it's day. But there's definitely more jobs in here. But, what's that? A big stick. Are you serious? I'm just going to hide in here for a second. Not what I wanted to do. Zoom out. Welcome to Engineer's Life 2 Mod Pack. This is your guide or quest book here. You can find sorts, some sort of guide progression with rewards and some explanations. Quests come in a number of different types. I think we'll try. Pretty much any of it. Huh. You can find the link on Google Drive to guide directly huh. to the let's see Curse Forge project. And I'm typing. I'll take the torch. Yeah. In game recipe browser. Uh, we have all familiar with the JEI, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Hovering over an item. Huh. Our key for recipes. Yeah. Huh. We'll display that. You yeah. shows what items can be used for it. Search bar, yeah, control F. Uh, uh. New mechanics, uh, there are a couple of new mechanics. Pack employees describes following this quest will always come back here to read again. Gain valuable benefits for eating greater varieties of food. Okay, so spice, slice a spice uh, of life, carrot additions in here. Uh, Level your abilities by gaining experience, skills, mining, combat, uh, endurance. Okay, that's new. Uh, Harvest groups of blocks at a time. Speed up mining, harvesting, and tilling. Okay. Leaves can be harvested without a tool or sticks. This is a vanilla feature, but very important here. Sticks can also be picked up off the ground. Hey. Strongholds are no longer boring end game structures. Alright, dude. You're like... What is this? Social gathering? What if I go in here? Will you bother me in here? Strongholds are no longer boring end game structures that you trek through just to get the end. Seriously, dude. Seriously. Stronghold structures become much more complex. Over 15 different rooms in a complex labyrinth. Okay. Secrets that you'll want to find, even journeying. Yeah, the Slice of Life Carrot Edition. Level of Diversity. 
We died. That sucks. Never fear. Your stuff won't disappear. Corpse mod. Corpse mod. Your inventory will remain on the corpse. All right. On with the days. Crafting obsidian doorways to the nether. Young better portals has changed the way that you navigate to and from the nether. Deep underground, you'll find nether rifts in the pockets of the nether that will be risen into the overworld containing the portal pools. By jumping the portal pool, you will one-way transportation trip to the nether. There you will find adventure and monolith and altars containing the reclaimer who will be able to transport you back to the overworld. Okay, so it's a one-way trip to the nether. Good to know. Terra module tool mod that was interrogation. Terra allows you to take basic vanilla tools and upgrade them. I'm not real big on the Terra, honestly. Alright, there's seasons. I'm busy in here, guy. Build guide will help you with your builds by giving you ghost layouts to common shapes of builds. Press B to bring up its build. I would recommend changing this so it doesn't conflict with the backpack. All right, or excavation, tilde key, renders white lines, harvest crops, right click on them. Menu access. And there's an array of new stats, different abilities. Mining increases mine speed, excavation, picking up treasure. Different XP modifiers skill based on your current biomes. Create a job. Huh. You can create or join a party using. Okay, that's for the. If you're playing with a group. I do want the reward though. Agility skills is gained in a number of ways. Sprinting for faster potions can boost this. Jumping. Saving fall. Higher levels of ability will get faster sprinting. Okay. Endurance. Higher levels of endurance will decrease the amount of damage taken from hits. Increase the amount of extra hearts you have and will contribute to how long you stay underwater. Healing effects across time. Okay. So endurance would be a good one. Flying. Flying is gained by flying around with elytra. There's no bonus to higher levels of this skill. Swimming. Grant two advantages. Underwater night vision and the ability to stay underwater longer. Okay, so that kind of like makes enchanting a little bit less necessary. Uh, higher levels will increase the amount of damage you do with a melee weapon. Increases extra damage with bows. Excavation. Higher levels asking you to dig faster to find trigger blocks when digging. Drop extra extra items when mining. That's interesting. As you cut trees faster and have the possibility of dropping extra wood blocks. Uh, farming will allow you to harvest more crops from a single plant. And harvest them faster. Harvesting them faster. Fishing. Fishing will be able to catch special items. Higher levels increase the probability of catching better items with better enchants. Huh. Cooking. Cooking foods. Higher levels of cooking allow the possibility of extra foods of making cooking foods. Okay, so make one huh. hot dog, you can make two. Building skill. Higher levels increases the reach damage that you can place blocks. Oh, that's kind of convenient. Smelting. Smelting items, repairing items, salvaging items. Higher levels give you uh, ore, the possibility of getting extra product. Higher level of increasing success rate of salvaging and increasing the possibility of salvage products. Increasing the amount of repaired when using an anvil. The amount repaired when using an anvil. And less likely to break it. Huh. Crafting gained by crafting recipes, either inventory or in the crafting table. There is no bonus for higher level skill sets. Pretty expected. Alchemy, higher levels of skill will allow possibly of extra potions brewed when brewing a potion. So. Okay. 
picking up stones found on the ground to the world by holding the stone in both hands. Well, I know we have a little skeleton company out here. I'm not sure where he is. Oh, he could be under the house. Okay. Yes. So, apparently we're going to be staring at the ground for a little bit. I wonder, can I cut a tree? Although I should be salvaging through these people's village, honestly. What do we use these for? Oh, look at that. We have already made cobblestone. Hello, Piggy, with your head in the wall. Oh, that's different. Oh, what's this? Ooh, getting interesting. Alright, but first we need to make a tool. Wait, I can't make a tool until I get wood. Alright, so... Hello, little miniature villagers. You happen to have wood lying around in your homes. What? Oh, it's a cat. Hello. No, but you have a lot of variety. And you're very loud. You are very loud. Can we, like, adjust that a little bit? Not the one I wanted. Uh, volume. Music and sounds. Uh, friendly creatures. We'll just, uh, take you down 25% and see. The slamming doors is also annoying. I'm sorry, but... Options. Would that be blocks? Take the weather down too, just in case. We want to be able to hear the hostile mobs though. There. Oh, not as ear deafening. Hmm. I have to find gravel. Not quite what I wanted. What about over in this section? No. Oh, muddy pigs! Ah. Do I hear a dragon? Interesting build up there, though. But I want to sleep now, sir. Like, let me sleep. Let me sleep. I'm pretty sure there's something out there that's a hydra or something, because I just heard, like, a huge hiss. Is there alligators in here? Is there alligators? Am I hearing an alligator? What? No, my bed. You're a hunter. I am also a hunter. Alright. Yay for Bay Miner. Now. Said you. Good. Oh my god, that's a lot of awareness. I think it's in the last couple of minutes. Can I? 
Break a piece of wood, please. Please? Please? No? No? Really? Alright. Apparently we have to make flint tools, and they're not in the list. So, where is my hatchet? There is no hatchet. There's a flint shovel. Where is the quest book? I need a guide. Thank you. Shards. I have to nap. Um. Oh, cobblestone counts, right? We can nap on the cobblestone, right? I have to make the knife. That's what it is. You. Uh, my inventory's getting a little bit full. Um. Um. Oh, I have a backpack already. How do I use it? B. Right? Oh, right. They want to change the control options in the building. Is it building? Open the building guide will be... That one's... There we go. Now we should be able to open the backpack. Okay. That didn't work. What's this? B. Of course, it's not going to be any of these ones. Let's uh, go with that one. There we go. Well, Animal Dictionary won't be too useful right now. These will not be useful right now. Log of an unknown traveler. Climb balls. Now, I imagine the knife is used on grass. What are you? Uh, a slimy nest. Oh, bees. Thank you. I don't want to be your supper, sir. Uh. All right, so now we got that. Saplings. Uh, I imagine this is the same as every other recipe. Three plant fibers? Yep. Get that. Now we can make the flint hatchet. There we go. One of those. Now we can get some wood. Okay, sound again. Oh, that might be environment. Oh. 
That may be environment. Nope. Nope. Go find somebody else to eat. Nope. I I'm I'm very bony. I don't taste good. Huh. Just stay in the center of town. Yeah. Maybe maybe it'll be safer. Is that you that did that noise? It is you, isn't it? Here, but give me your leather. I might need the eyeball. But maybe give me this chest, because... It doesn't seem to be... I'm curious what's up there, though. No workstations. Clean your homes better, guys. Ah! Well, my potato now. Acorn. Great place for a tree, right in the middle of the road. Hi. No, I didn't think so. Clearly going to need this more. Tomato seeds. Don't know if I need the pine cone. What? Oh, my wood cutting leveled up. Are you a sheep? You look more like a goat. Oh, I got four more things I could chop with this uh, log before. Or uh, hatch it before it busts. Oh, you look like an interesting building. Is there anything good up here? Whoop. No, of course not. Just an interesting building. With uh, clearly a yard issue going on here. Need some of my barley bread. Mmm. Well, I'm not going to leave. I don't want to go too far over there. Mr. Alligator still wants a piece of me. I feel like Captain Hook over here. I'll definitely have some apples and berries. Oh, I can get crafting table now. As soon as we figure out the room issue going on here. Mm. I suppose I could eat these berries. There we go. Uh, let's see. Hatchet. I uh, guess we're going to need another one. Actually, no, we won't, because we'll be able to get into stone tools in a second. There we go. Right? Yes. 
Too blunt to use. Oh, that's just cruel. Oh, that's just mean. What about sword? Too blunt to use. Well, you just ruined my dreams of a easy future. I have to interact with you a whole lot. Does this count? Interact. Fifty-six. Interact. It does. I throw my carrots away, though. We're totally cheesing this. That's what you get for giving me an interactive quest. I will do this two hundred and some times. There. Quest complete. Ha ha ha. There's what I have to say to your interactive building crafting table thing. <laughs>